Over the last several years, local and state law enforcement have been more focused on the various forms of human trafficking. But now a new movie in theaters may be bringing even more attention to the subject. Here's First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti. Is one of the biggest movies of the summer educating people on the impact of human sex trafficking. Can we tell you what is fact from fiction in our area, in our community, and how it affects people that we live and work with? Stacy Altier is with the Trumbull County Health District and is also director for the Ohio Response Recovery and Interaction Network, which focuses on human trafficking. That's the subject of Sound of Freedom, which is now playing in Boardman and theaters around the country and stirring up some controversy. That's the point. It is thought-provoking. It does start a conversation. Mahoning County Sheriff Jerry Green oversees the Valley's Human Trafficking Task Force, which has staged a number of sting operations targeting men trying to meet young children for sex. He thinks the movie's subject matter sheds a light on the problem that places Ohio fourth worst in the country. Every time we're able to show how many predators there are out there uh, looking for underage children and just, you know, looking for people in the sex trade, uh, it, it creates an awareness. But Altier says the movie may also encourage parents to pay more attention to their children's activities, especially online, and others to learn the potential signs of trafficking. To reach out to local resources, to have those educators come in and speak to them so they do know what to look for and how to, you know, really see what's going on. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.